When we watch a CNC machine and we see the code scrolling by on the controller and we see the complex motions that happen inside the machine, it's important to remember that these machines actually only move in three ways. You can move from point A to point B in a straight line at a specific speed. Now you command that with a G01 command and you have to have told the machine how fast you want it to go, either on that line of code or on a previous line of code. If we want to move in an arc motion, we can move from point A to point B in a constant radius arc. Now if we want a clockwise arc, we'll command a G02 and if we want a counterclockwise arc, we'll command a G03. And again, both of these moves require a feed rate, and it has to be either declared on the line of code where you program this, or in a previous line of code. If we want to move from point A to point B as fast as the machine can get from one place to another, we use a G00 command and that G00, it does not necessarily move in a straight line. In fact, the, the typical machine tool controller will have it move at 45 degrees until it finds one of those positions and then move in a straight line the rest of the way. We call that a dog leg rapid move. And so, although there are over 100, maybe 150 different G and M codes that we use to control the machine tool, only four of them control the motion of the machine and those are the only motions that the machine can make. Everything else is either turning something on, turning something off. It's talking about the work coordinate system or the tool coordinates and the tool offsets that we've programmed in the machine. It's telling the machine what direction we want to go if we do an arc motion or it's, it's some combination of this G01 straight line move G023 arc moves and G00 rapid moves that have been programmed all together in something that we call a canned cycle or sometimes even a macro. So remember, no matter how complex the motion in the machine seems, it's either moving point to point in a straight line at a specific speed, it's moving point to point in an arc motion with a constant radius arc at a specific speed, or it's just moving as fast as it can. We do the G01 and the G02 and 3. We're expecting the tool to be in contact with the workpiece material, and we think that we're going to be making chips. When we do a G00 command, we almost always expect that we are not in contact with the workpiece material. And this is just to move as quickly as possible from the beginning of one cut to the beginning of the next, or from the end of one cut to the beginning of the next cut, or from the tool change location to the beginning of the cut, or from the end of the cut back to the tool change location. That's all there is to it. Machines move three ways.